Made in Abyss. I went into this knowing what was going to happen. Well, knowing something bad was going to happen. Something that my soul and my brain was not going to like. And... Yeah, I still liked it. I still thought it was a really good experience and a fun journey. Can't wait for season two, but I'm doing this. So this is a review of the first season and the third movie. I did watch the first movie just to see if there was anything a little extra in there. There is, but not enough to recommend watching it. Just, if you haven't got the time, watch the movies. If you do have time, watch the first season. But yeah, I love the monster designs. I love the lore. It's a lot to take in. I love the characters. Hello, Eset. Reminding me to do things. But yeah, I really do love it. There's a couple things that... I do recommend, above all, to keep it to a few episodes at a time. If not, your brain is going to explode from the amount of lore you need to remember, the story, the characters, what happens. It does, and you might think to yourself that you're ready for the next horrible thing that's going to happen, or ready for the next, uh... Yeah, just the next horrible thing. You're not. Trust me, you're not. No, you ain't. <laughs> but, yes, I do highly recommend this. But if you're not good with horror, if you're not good with horrible things happening to good people, to innocent people, don't watch this. <laughs> go watch go watch One Piece. Go watch uh, Is the Order Rabbit. Go watch something cute and adorable and not harmful to your soul in the least. <laughs> yeah, I love Nanachi as a character. Completely from me off guard because I thought... Ooh, this is hard not to spoil this. <laughs> well, technically the user's spoiling it, so... But yeah, Absolutely love it. It is a lot to take in. So yeah, a few episodes at a time, and then do not dive straight into the movie. No matter how much free time you have, do not dive straight into the movie either. You are not ready for it. You need you need to give yourself a couple of days, give yourself a week, maybe a month to just process what happened in the first, the last few episodes. Yeah, I would have gotten the game, but it's so expensive, and it's got a few mixed reviews here and there. I have seen the <laughs> the game over screens. They are. You know, they could have been worse, they could have been way worse. I've seen worse horror in video games, I've seen worse gore. But yeah, Season 2 is coming out, I do highly recommend this. It is Japan, it is Japan anime, so there are a couple of things that'll make you go, Ugh, no, why'd they do that? So yeah, just, just prepare yourself mentally for Made in Abyss. Truly, I always recommend this, and yeah, I recommend it as well. Oh, we still got time left, because five minute reviews. Oh, look at this, look at the designs. Oh, it's hard not to spoil all of this. Oh, can't wait for season two to come out. Yeah, I love designs, love the animation, the music. I would say the music's a bit okay. It doesn't it doesn't help that I'm more distracted by what's going on on the screen from my eyes than from my ears. But oh, it's hard to really talk about this without spoiling it. It is really hard to talk about it without spoiling it. Uh, if I had to put it in a nutshell, a zombie, a robot, and a mutant go on an adventure. There you go. <laughs> if I had to put it into as few words as possible. Just, uh, just keep that in mind. Robot, zombie, and mutant. Adventure. Oh, even that might be spoilers, actually. <laughs> oh, God, yep, there they are. Oh, those are the horrible things. I'm not gonna censor it. Just be prepared. That's all I'm going to say. Be prepared. It is... They aren't... It doesn't horror all the time. It's just when the horror does hit, it hits hard. You know, it gets all science-y. It gets all... Yeah, this is science horror. If I, had to, if I had to best describe it, yes, science horror. Like, it goes into great detail about the... Ooh, genetics and the... Yes, yeah, see this right here. That. I know you can tell you what that is, because I don't know if YouTube's going to like that. <laughs> I would recommend the game, but I haven't played it does look like it's trying to do Breath of the Wild, but different. <laughs> Ooh, what are we doing for time here? Oh, 30 seconds left. So yeah, I do highly recommend this. Just be prepared mentally for horrible things to happen. Taking the lore, taking the really good, beautiful designs, well, some of the scarier designs even. The characters, their story, the things that happen to them. You're going to be very sad. Be prepared, you might need to see a therapist or two, but it's worth it, trust me. As long as you're prepared for that and horrible things to happen, it'll be alright. So, I'll see you guys next time for 5 Minute Reviews. Bye-bye.